Hi dear students. So let's see this question that came in J Advanced 2022 Paper 2 Physics. This was a question from rotational motion and this was a single choice correct question. So if you get this right, you get plus 3. If you get this wrong, you get minus 1. Otherwise, you get 0. Now, uh, in this question, basically the disc A and B are identical and <coughs> both of them uh, have uh, same radius and mass. Uh, basically, and um, uh, the center of the disc A is fixed. That means disc A is whole, like fixed. It's not, not only the center, like whole disc A is fixed. That means it is immovable. And the uh, disc B rolls on the edge, on the circumference of the disc A without, pure, without slipping. Okay. So basically, if you consider this uh, C to be the center of the disc B and O to be the center of the disc A, then C is going to move in a circular path of radius 2R. You can see over here. This is 2R. So C is going to move in a circular path of radius 2R uh, like with respect to point O. And we have to find the angular momentum of the disc B uh, with respect to point O. Now, uh, we have also been given that angular velocity of line OC is omega. That means this line OC is rotating at an angular velocity of omega, right? Uh, now, first of all, we will find the angular velocity of disc C about its own center. So, let's call this to be omega C, okay? Uh, how we can find this? Uh, we can use the relation that uh, velocity of center C can be written by two ways. First is, if you uh, write the velocity of center C with respect to point O, uh, which is stationary anyway. So, point O ke frame mein OC is moving at a angular velocity of omega and the distance is 2R. So, velocity of C can be written as this 2R into omega using the logic of circular motion. Now, you know that this point is not slipping. The, the point of contact is not slipping. So, we can say that since this point is not slipping, hence uh, Vc can also be written as R omega because if we stand on this point, then this point will be at rest and at, uh, at this with respect to this point, uh, any point on the B will be moving in a circular motion. Okay, this point I am considering on the disc B. So, this point I have disc B. Pe liya hai. ठीक है डिस्क बी का जो बॉटम पॉइंट है जो कांटेक्ट पॉइंट है वो पॉइंट के रिस्पेक्ट में सेंटर की वेलोसिटी आर ओमेगा सी वी कैन राइट ओके यूजिंग द कंडीशन ऑफ प्योर रोलिंग सो वी कैन से दैट ओमेगा सी कम्स आउट टू बी 2 ओमेगा हेंस द एंगुलर वेलोसिटी ऑफ डिस्क बी अबाउट इट्स ओन सेंटर इज ट्वाइस द एंगुलर वेलोसिटी ऑफ लाइन ओ सी ओके नाउ द क्वेश्चन इज वेरी सिंपल सो एंगुलर मोमेंटम अबाउट पॉइंट ओ इज वेरी सिंपल सो वी नो दैट हाउ टू राइट द एंगुलर मोमेंटम ऑफ अ रिजिड बॉडी अबाउट एनी एक्सटर्नल पॉइंट First, you write the angular momentum about center of mass and then write the angular momentum of the center of mass uh, about the external point. So, angular momentum about the center of mass will be IC into omega C plus M into VC into 2R. Okay. So, IC is nothing but half into M into R square into omega C is 2 omega plus M into VC is nothing but 2R into omega into 2R. Right. So, this becomes 5 m omega r square so n comes out to be 5 okay uh, you will be happy to know that guys this question was also like i always take this question in my class illustration that means find this relation so like many of the students uh they like those whom i had taught they like you know they became very happy when they saw this question j advanced this year thank you